raid lights, performer short tights. As you can see, uh, colorway is grey with uh, uh, a white, um, very bold logo. The shorts under shorts are white with some really nice contrast in grey and red uh, detailing there. Um, the first thing to note, guys, is that these are quite see-through, so um, you know, be careful of any modesty. It should be should be preserved pretty well because these are sewn in on the side, so the danger of them coming up is, is really really uh, unlikely. Um, they're extremely lightweight. Um, they're about 110 approximate grams, um, which puts them in the ultra lightweight category. Um, they're very, very comfortable because the inner short goes all the way up and it, it keeps everything in, in check uh, and, and uh, very comfortable and, and I'm really happy with that. Um, the material is a, a polyurethane, polyamide, ripstock composition mix. Uh, it works well. Uh, my only question mark is is durability. You know, it is quite a lightweight material. Um, if you run on trails like I do, you can catch and snag on branches, twigs, bushes, etc. Uh, I've got away unscathed thus far, but it could happen. I, I, I'll let you know if something ever happens to them, if, if, that's, uh, if that occurs. Um, Fit-wise and sizing-wise, really important that wherever you buy these from, that you do your very best to speak to someone at that shop. Uh, I got mine from myracekit.com and I was speaking to Elizabeth there. Um, these guys run in, in, in these shorts, so they know them really, really well and they know the sizing. I would have gone for large, but I'm, I'm a medium. I'm a medium in every every short that I can go for, but when you look at the website, it tells you perhaps to size up. But speak to them and get the advice that you need to make sure that you get the right product, the right size and the right product. I'm really glad that I did because large would have been too big. Um, medium is, is perfect for me. You can tell what I, I really I'm really impressed by is the, the, the mess mesh uh, uh, sorry mesh uh, pockets on the side. Um, I'm really it's what I was going for when I did my research into finding the shorts that had pockets and you can see They've got two on either side with a, an elasticated lip. Um, if I put my phone in, you'll see just how much room there is. Uh, and this is an HTC One, so this is quite a big phone, you know, akin to your Samsung or, or your, your iPhone. I mean, testament to how hard it is to get in is how hard stuff's going to be to come out. And I can verify that, you know, I've put maybe three or four gels in each of these pockets um, by way of trial and, and you know, minimal bounce. Um, and uh, nothing fell out, so uh, they absolutely work. And I like the fact they're on the side rather than on the back, uh, because I'm not a big fan of anything bouncing um, at the back. Um, so for me, a real a real win. Price wise, 60 quid. You know, so they're not cheap, but they're not the most expensive. About there, you know, Salomon are producing shorts from 60, 70, 100 and plus, 110, 120 quid. So you know, whilst these may have been engineered differently, they're nearly half the price of what Salomon are producing and they're, they're, they're as lightweight, you know, they, these guys aren't paying for the, the sponsorship of, uh, of elite athletes either, so you know, they're probably getting away with it a little bit more, but to me, easily comparable, you know, they've got pockets on the side rather than on the back, I prefer them there because there's less bounce, and it's tucked in right to your side, and yet they're not going anywhere. Um, and these guys, they do their, their product testing in the mountains in France, so they really know what they're, they're, they're doing with it. Just make sure you get the sizing absolutely right. Pick up the phone and speak to whoever you're going to buy it from, and make sure that uh, they, they give you the right advice. Uh, and don't trust what it says on the Raid Light website because it's crazy uh, uh, sizing chart that they have uh, based on height and weight. Uh, so who, go figure. Um, but great shorts, guys, really recommend them. So that concludes my review of Raid Light's Performer Short Tights. Uh, great product, nine, maybe ten out of ten. Really close. I mean, they're just such a good, uh, such a good product. Really sensible price point, um, and really just get extra delivery from them because of this slightly quirky nature of the of the brand. I mean, uh, most people will know them on the ultra marathon scene. They're not particularly well known in the UK because most people don't do ultra marathons in the UK, um, and they'll probably favour uh, uh, your more mainstay brands. But if you get the chance to to try these products out, do so. They're really good. 
Um, and I, I, I only found them because I did my research and I found them at uh, myracekit.com. There's their, their website. Go and check them out. They're very specialist, very good product knowledge, and they're really passionate about running. So they'll only tell you what, what you need to know about the, uh, the, the product that you're looking into. They'll answer your questions simply. Um, they've tried and tested just about everything in their shop. I can testify to that because I've asked them loads of questions about lots of different things. Um, and um, they will support you throughout the, uh, the, the process. So go and check them out. Please follow me on Twitter at Endure and Enjoy, where I will have hints, tips, other product reviews um, and thoughts. If you've got any comments about uh, what you've uh, what you've been viewing today, please do post. If you've got any questions about it, please post, um, and I will come back to you as quickly as I can with any uh, any answers that I uh, that I can. Um, in the meantime, thanks very much. Get out there, guys. Endure it, but most of all, enjoy it.